I started the nursery right out of college uh, in 1989. I didn't start working full time at the nursery till about 92. Um, so it's been a while now. We are seeing more and more people uh, putting in rain gardens. Um, sometimes their arms are twisted by their municipalities to do some sort of uh, a rain garden to process any uh, drainage from an addition or a driveway extension or a swimming pool now. Uh, apparently some townships, if you put in a pool, you have to have a, a rain garden. Um, we're seeing that. We are seeing a lot of people planning for pollinators. Uh, coming in saying, I read about how important it is to save our pollinators. You know, what plants do you have? What do you recommend? Um, and we're seeing, we're starting to see more people realizing that lawns are not great for the environment and they're trying to reduce their lawn area, which is terrific. Lawns, lawns do nothing. Um, plants help. <laughs>So I'm here with uh, Bill Donnelly from Bamerwalds Nursery, and we've just learned a little bit about Bamerwalds. Uh, but I'd like to tell you a little bit more about what Bill has done for the Conservancy. So he's done four things uh, over the past couple years that have really helped the Conservancy out. First of all, he's really helped with our plant sale. So every spring the Conservancy has a plant sale, and Bill has generously donated 20% of all of his profits uh, from the trees and shrubs that he sells with us at the plant sale, uh, which is very generous uh, of, of him. Secondly. Bill always helps out with the stream cleanup. He recruits his neighbors and works here on the East Branch right below his property and always puts out a really good spread for his neighbors with uh, donuts and cookies and brownies. So if you ever want to get involved with the stream cleanup, you should be on Bill's site. Uh, third, Bill always helps with our uh, plant-a-thon, which we have in, in the fall. So typically the Conservancy plants anywhere between 1,000 and 2,000 trees, and we rely heavily on Bill uh, to help us you know, fulfill those projects. And lastly, uh, Bill has been a great partner with the Conservancy, uh, just generally supporting us through the silent auction and donations over the last couple of years. And for all of those reasons, we wanted to present Bill with the Local Business Partner Award uh, for the 2020 environmental season. So thanks so much, Bill. Thank you very much, Ryan.